New words. New event. Today in Tarkov, we got a brand new event, which gives you an achievement and also is kind of a unique event that uh, other games do here and there where you actually pick your side and whichever side gets the most, uh, well, what later will be shown to be kills, um, gets different rewards than the losing side or maybe the losing side doesn't get anything. So um, let's get right into it. The first quest is from Mechanic and it's gonna get you to go to Factory and just to kill 10 scavs and then you grab five of their weapons if they have Western Chambered uh, weapons and you just hand them in the Mechanic. Really simple quest, really fun to do. I mean, who doesn't wanna go to Factory, right? It's just, it's a good map and you're only killing, you only have to kill scavs. You don't even have to fuck with the PMCs or Tegilla or whatever. So this is one that's just really easy and you get three military power filters which is just nuts because they go for like six mil the second quest is called what's your evidence it'll be from peacekeeper and it's just more or less the same thing you just have to give him 10 western scav weapons with low durability very low durability it says so just don't repair them and then just hand them in as you can the third quest is going to be unfortunately going to Lighthouse. I know a lot of people don't like Lighthouse because of how tricky it is to traverse. But um, you got to go into the three water treatment plants, the entrances to each, and just stash a Wi Fi camera in there. And then you can get out. This is way easier said than done. It's a tricky area, and I know a lot of people will struggle with it. But if you just watch a few videos on how to clear out the rogues uh, accurately, um, I could even post a video of my strategy of doing it um it's just a lot of patience and patience and then slowly picking them off from afar but you know if it, you'll get it done it's uh it's definitely the most difficult on this quest line in my opinion but um yeah so this is where it starts to divulge this is where you get the choices you can either go with proper or you can go with peacekeeper and these are kind of the two factions that you can pick through that players can pick and i believe at the end of the event whichever has the most progress done gets the rewards type deal so let's just run that uh run that through quickly so the next one is for proper this is proper's quest line this is one of the options you can take and once you take it you run with it and you all you have to do is you go to streets tarkov you kill three pmcs you don't go to lexos you don't kill cabans guards and you just extract and you pretty much just walk right through this quest this is a e super easy quest um you get paid decently you get rep and you get a bunch of xp and it's it's just that easy and you also get moonshine and it just it's just a walk in the park so this is probably going to be the most popular one out of the bunch because peacekeepers i think which i'll pull up put up here shortly is you actually have to go and kill um gus and bash mac and you know people don't a lot of i'm sure people just would rather take the pmc route for pbe and just get it over and done with um so yeah let me bring up the peacekeeper quest here so here's peacekeepers quest and it's just locate and eliminate bash mac and gus and it's just as simple as the other one except this time it's a little harder you got to go to lexos and you just gotta pretty much clear out caban and his guards um it's pretty easy once you do that you extract and you're on to um peacekeeper side of the quest which both sides are very similar it's just one caliber versus the other so let's go into that Right here is Peacekeeper's quest, which it's open-ended because it's part of the event. And when you get this quest, you are officially on the side of Peacekeeper. There's no going back. And all you do is you just take Western weapons. It could be M4s, all that stuff. And you just kill targets. You kill as many as you can. You just keep, keep, you just use, it's just asking to use weapons throughout the event. And once this all gets tallied up, if your side is victorious, you get this amount of rewards. I'm not sure if you if you get the rewards right away or not, but um, I know there are rewards for whichever faction comes out on top of the most kills. And here's proper side. It's just a carbon copy of Peacekeepers, except flip flopped. And this time you're supporting proper and you're just same thing. You're eliminating as many targets as you can. So just go on factory and have a chicken shoot um and just have fun this is a super fun event aside from having to go do streets of tarkov and lighthouse 
Um, I know those maps are troublesome for, for many. Um, Lighthouse being, you know, rogues and having to clear them out and having to actually have to go to where they are actually for part of the quest. And then Streets of Tarkov just for the poor optimization and, and the fact that for PvE, you can't go there single player. So the queue times are probably going to be ass. But, you know, after, once you get over that hurdle, it's just, it's, it's fun. It's super good and super fun to do. So I'm going to put up on the screen the calibers that you have to use for each faction. Here's Peacekeeper's list. It's just Western calibers, so 300 blackout, 556, 7.65, 51 NATO. It's uh, it's all pretty straightforward. Um, and then here is Prat War, same thing. It's just it's just Russian calibers and well Eastern calibers, I guess. And uh, you just go out and you kill people, and then uh, I guess all that gets tallied up. And at the end of the event one side gets the spoils the other side might not i'm not sure how it works but yeah that, that's the event and you also get an achievement for completing all the all the quests which is pretty cool of uh of bsg to do you know i think these achievement oriented events are really cool i thought the last one was super fun and um yeah it was it's just really cool to see this in the game so i hope that uh clarifies things for you guys i hope you guys enjoy it and i'll see you guys next time